Welcome to Wrestling Talk in the Shop, where we cover all things professional wrestling, from new wrestling to classic wrestling and everything in between. We go to wrestling, we do some wrestling, and everything in the ring. Join us now for Wrestling Talk in the Shop. Hey guys, it's John and Wrestling Talk in the Shop. And uh, this is my co-host here, Lindsay. Hey. We just got through. Uh, Vengeance Day just went off the air, and uh, Carmelo Hayes finally made that push and went on and uh, beat up Trick Williams. And is that his name, Trick Williams? Yes. Uh, Trick. But anyway, Trick. Uh, he's gonna do uh, better without him anyway. Oh yeah, he'll be. Fine. I like Trick. Seen that like, coming a mile away. Yeah, I mean everybody's seen that. You know, it's sort of coming. But, I mean, it was an overall good show. It seems like every week, man. I mean, you just can't hardly catch a day. <laughs> it used to be Netflix and chill. Now let's watch wrestling and chill. I mean, every day we get a... Uh, every day there's wrestling on TV. We can't uh, watch anything else. <laughs> but, anyway, the show opened with uh, Carmelo Hayes and Trick versus Braun Breaker and Baron Corbin. And everybody, and everybody should have known who was winning. So, and then the uh, winners were Braun Breaker and uh, Baron Corbin. And I, I know Braun Breaker is off to the main roster. Yeah. I'm not sure about uh, Baron Corbin. Uh, I don't know if he's headed where he's. I think they'll send him back or they'll keep him on the I don't know. He's, uh, but he, he shines with that tag team. I think they should send them both up there, which I know Baron Corbin would do good as a single wrestler, but, you know, no surprise Braun there. Braun Breaker, you know, he's doing fine as a single that's, wrestler. That's what I meant. Yeah. Braun, I, I said, I said, Baron, Baron I said Baron Corbin. I meant Braun Breaker will be a super standout guy. I mean, but I, I said Baron Corbin, but I meant Braun Breaker. But anyway, uh, so they win. They are the 2024 uh, Dusty Classic champions. Yeah. They're going to celebrate. Yeah. And uh, then we had Joe Gacy versus Dijak. I thought that was a pretty good match. Uh, Joe Gacy, he sort of reminds me of Cactus Jack Manson. You know. Definitely. Uh, I like his little toy soldiers on the table. But uh, and no surprise there, Dijak got the win. But uh, yeah, Joe I mean, Gacy they beat him was, up the whole time. Yeah, so. he was smiling as he was being pinned. You know, he was he was happy in defeat. And then uh, the family, the family uh, versus uh, OTM. OTM and. Uh, the family won there, the right person, the right, you know, the family. They got a pretty good gimmick going. And the uh, uh, Lyra Vaccarie. No, don't forget, you can buy your calendars yeah. on WWE Shop. Yeah, you uh, Chase University yeah. there. <laughs> I'm sure there's people helping them out. Oh, yeah. I'm sure. Uh, Who's on the calendar? Oh, I don't know. Guess you have to wait and see. I don't see. know. Guess you have to wait and see, you know. And uh, Lyra Vaccarie versus Roxanne Perez and Lola cashed in her opportunity, sort of her uh, breakout star competition. I guess you get it. I was kind of dumb on me. Why wouldn't you wait till the match was over and then run out and cash it in? Maybe they can't. I don't know the stipu stipulations. It's yeah. not like Money in the Bank. Maybe I don't. You know, I, I'm not a regular viewer of NXT. So, uh, but uh, Lyra, what's her name? Lyra. Lyra Vaccarie retained her title. Yeah. yeah. Forgive me for butchering these names, and then, uh, and then somebody backstage uh, was it Chase. Yeah. Chase, Chase. asked. Uh, I think it's Chase. The girl, she's had a crush on him throughout. You can see, you know, she's been, you know, had a crush on him, and she's gonna be his Valentine. It's gonna be Valentine. And then uh, Dragon Lee versus Obi for the NXT uh, North American Championship, and uh, Dragon Lee, I think he's a main roster star. You know, I see him more on SmackDown and. Uh, so I was surprised that they want to keep that NXT North American title oh, on yeah. a, on NXT brand. But uh, in backstage, you see uh, Roxanne and Lowry brought. Uh, you forgot to say Obi retained. Oh, oh, Obi retained. Yeah, he retained his title. Yeah, yeah. that was a good match. That was a very good match. Uh, I like Dragon Lee. To me, the the That's match of the night show. was the uh, was the uh, main event. I mean, but I mean, and of course uh, they had. What's his name? Oh, yeah, and then it, it went to a segment with Lo Roxanne and Lola brawling backstage. Right. She's still pissed. I'm yeah. me too. I messed <laughs> up my opportunity. Yeah. So. I can't say I wouldn't be. But. And then we had the NXT Championship match with Isla, 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 Ilya Dragunov. Yeah. We can't ever say his name right. Yeah. Just call him Dragunov. Versus uh, Trick Williams and... Uh, and fans in uh, fans. Clarksville, Tennessee, they really want a trick to win. You oh, know? yeah, they did. And, uh, you know, he'll get his time. And, he, get... and if the ref wouldn't have been knocked out by old Yeah, he Carmelo, clearly had a five, five six, like seven count. Seven or eight or something like that. But, so uh, he could have won. And then after the match, the ref was 
Knock Carmelo off. Hayes turned heel and, uh, you know, he's been beat leading Beat the up. tar out of him. Yeah, <laughs> bent that chair up. Beat the chair, his poor yeah. leg. Yeah, he got his chair all the way up. He could be black and blue tomorrow. But overall, it's a very solid show. I mean, I'm going to continue to watch NXT. Like I said, I worried it. we the last three or four weeks, month, we've just been viewers of NXT. But we're, overall, I mean, that was a very solid match. Or a very solid pay per view. It's not a bad or show. PPV or whatever they want to call it. Once you get it. into you yeah. know the people and learn who they are, yeah. so that yeah. helps. Uh, and you know they called up um, Tiffany Stratton, so yeah. she's not on there anymore. Yeah, she's on the main. She on. She's her, on SmackDown. She had her SmackDown debut. Yeah. Okay. So that's probably bad for them. They lost anyway, her. we just wanted to come out. I, like I said, to me, the uh, Ilian Dragonoff and the Trick Win was the match of the night. I mean, everybody wanted to see Trick Win. Yeah. But He'll get another chance. Yeah, he'll get his shot. And I figure at their at their uh, mania weekend it'll be uh Trick versus uh Carmelo Hayes. That's what Fig say you think they'll have a mania match. Yeah, they match. have they, they have a uh, not a mania match, but they have an event. Oh, that week. Yeah, that okay. week. You know. So and I guess NXT is headed back on the road. I guess that's what, is yeah, that what she said. That's what yeah. she said. I forgot where she said. Yeah, they're, I know they were gonna do it. They're gonna do it, I'm sure Tony Khan's probably pulling his hair out right now. I think they're doing a Memorial Day weekend show. You know, anyway. is he doing? Yeah, they always do one uh, double or nothing. Oh, yeah, double or we nothing. We went to it's it last year. But, anyways, guys, we just want to hop on here and uh, just, uh our son's texting us goodnight. <laughs> he's <laughs> going was, to bed. He's going to bed. But, anyway, overall, A plus show. Very, very satisfied good. with it. And uh, if you like what we're doing here, give us a thumbs up, like, and subscribe, hit that notification bell. Had to watch TV, now we're tired. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Thanks.